Hi, welcome. Nice hat. Thank you. I'm a fan. The bucket hat, isn't it? Oh my god, it's a little crooked. Hold on. I need it. I need it to be like in its full cow glory. Yes, so also, by the way, spoiler alert, I actually have built cars before. So I built two. I built the Soya and the blue one from the original run. I have used it before. I do know what I'm getting into, and I'm very excited because I know what I'm getting into. These colors, though, slap. Is the silicone worth $45 for the car? If you like a muted sound, yes, buy it. If you don't, nah. It's up to you. I personally prefer it with the silicone. It is entirely your decision. So... I have already filmed an unboxing of these on TikTok, so you guys aren't going to get too pretty, but essentially the car will come in a box like this. You have an assembly manual, very handy, 10 out of 10. Um, this is the silicone pad that will go between our plate and PCB. Um, it also has our plate in here as well. And then here are our units. So this is it in mint. I think this might be my favorite after puff. Um, I was stupid when they asked me what colors I wanted. I said mint and momo because I thought you guys would need to see that the most because puff is just obviously beautiful, but I'm now regretting not getting puff myself. So this is mint. And then over here we have momo. Look. All right. So here it is in momo. Also, I keep saying puff. I mean musk. I'm so sorry. Musk is the, is the pink one. But there we go. And then here we have our accessories box. So this is where all of the hardware, etc., comes in. Um, so yep, I have here the screws, the feet, no, the screws, the cable, and the Allen wrench. I'm gonna use everything that comes in this package just like to help you guys for when you get yours in. Um, it also comes with keycap puller as well. I love the updates that they made to the keycap puller, by the way. The feet are here. And then additional screws and the silicone dampener. And then also, of course, comes with the hot swap PCB. Also, side note, because I know this is a concern some of y'all have, um, the PCB does come with per key, but not under a glove. Other than the color, anything different for round one versus round two of Kara? Um, yes, not design-wise. Design-wise, it is the exact same. This is the same keyboard, different colors. But you do now have the option to purchase different back pieces. I don't know if you guys saw. So if you are getting mint, but you want, say, the clear pink back piece because you want to do a watermelon theme build, you can do that. Um, or if you want uh, it in black because this is too cute for you, you can do that. So that's like the only difference I can think of between the first and the second, but beyond that, it's just the colors. Will there be a round three? Almost definitely, yes. So if there's not a color that you want, wait. So we're gonna use these mint ones, obviously, uh, with the gold wires. All right, I'm gonna put the silicone dampener aside for now. I would really like to build this one without the dampener. Um, so I'm gonna be honest with you guys, any injection molded board you are likely to not see changes in for a very long time, if ever. Um, injection molding tooling costs a lot of money. And the reason why you do it is to run multiple rounds of the same board, uh, high volume, generally speaking, for very cheap. Uh, so you put in the investment up front and then you don't change it. Um, so any of the injection molded boards, be it uh, the Icky, the Cara, the Portico, the NK65 Entry Edition, you aren't going to see changes on those for a very long time unless something is catastrophically wrong uh, because the tooling to make these is very expensive and the only reason you would invest that much money is to run multiple rounds. That color slaps, it's so good. <laughs> Did you keep your other two cars? Yes, and I used them regularly. In fact, Alan stole one of them. So I only have the Soya one with me because he stole the blue one. <laughs> I haven't seen that. I haven't seen that one in, in, in months. <laughs> what a thief. I know, he stole my frog too. He stole your frog? He stole fucking frog. I told you guys he would. He stole my frog. In fact, he had the audacity. He had the audacity chat to type and ask you guys what keyword he should steal from me in my chat. And he thought I wouldn't notice. I consider you all an accessory to theft. Is this top mount? Yes-ish. This is a bit of an odd mount. I would say technically it is still gasket mounted. So here we go. This is the polycarbonate plate and this is the mute mount silicone. Make sure that you're putting the side with the wire cut out down. That way your stabilizers will still work. Oop. 
make sure you put your plate the right way like I almost did. How much does this keyboard cost? $160. I want to go to the keyboard meetup so bad. Oh yeah, I forgot to announce. I will be at the Novel Keys keyboard meetup. Um, you can find more information on that on any of their platforms or thekeyboardmeetup.com. Um, I'm going to be there. Nathan's going to be there. I think we're the only two streamers confirmed to be there. Both of us will be giving uh, talks. Uh, so if you'd like to check those out. Um, I think it's uh, an extra, I think it's an extra $20. But all of that money will be going to the charity of our choice. I think Nathan is supporting an animal shelter. I'm supporting Girls Who Code. So if you guys would like to attend those breakout sessions, all the money will be going to charity and you can learn about cool things. All right, shall we put the keycaps on this? Would you recommend the car as an entry board? Absolutely. So I recommend the Icky more simply because it has more ways to customize to your preference in terms of feel and sound because you can add gaskets, change plates, um etc the car has less of that uh but this one is prettier and i personally prefer the sound and feel of it more even though it's less flexible so i recommend the eki more because i feel like more people can make that work for them um however i personally prefer this one slightly more so this is the car in mint so this is wait hold on let me test these <laughs> this is the Ramakara with Infiniki Islander on it and KTT peaches that have been lubed with 205 grade zero. C3 stabs also lubed with 205 grade zero and no dampeners uh, in it. Here we go. All right, shall we build the other one? I think we should do it with the dampener just once, especially since it doesn't take much time to put in. So for those of you who thought this sounded a little hollow for your liking, there is the dampener. What mount is the car at? Yes. All right, are we ready for sound test number two shot? So this is it with the dampener. Fingers crossed. Any dice. Any dice at all. Hold on. Oh, not quite. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, face cam froze too? Excellent. Love that for us. So this is the uh, Momo with no dampening uh, and the Matrix stabilizers. Uh, that I lubed and haven't checked the lubing on, so if there's rattle, don't kill me. Um, and GMK peaches and cream.
All right, there you go. Cool. All right. All right. I'm out, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye-bye.